Cyberbrokers is excited to announce support for Delegate.cash throughout our universe as a way to help keep holders' assets safe while still accessing the utility. In this video, we're going to cover what Delegate.cash is, how Cyberbrokers is using it, and step-by-step -step instructions so you can get it set up yourself. The first question is probably, why are we doing this? And the answer to that is very simple. For months, We've all seen people post on Twitter and Discord about how they've lost assets through some phishing or scam attack. And it's because they're using a cold wallet as their primary wallet. This puts your assets at risk, period. Using Delegate.cash fixes that and we'll show you how. So what exactly is Delegate.cash? It's a simple and elegant solution based upon a smart contract. To use this, you basically have two wallets, a cold wallet, where you keep all your important assets and you don't connect to much, and a hot wallet, a little ETH to do all your minting, and a place where you can degen and not worry about losing your assets. Then the association of your hot and cold wallet gets stored on chain. It's important to note that this does not give any access to your wallet, it's just storing two pieces of information on chain for others to use. Using this information, anyone can then see the assets in your cold wallet when you connect with your hot wallet. At the same time, you're keeping your cold wallet assets safe. So let's walk through how Cyberbrokers is using this. We've created the Delegate page on our website to help you set up Delegate.cash quickly and easily. We've also created detailed information on what Delegate.cash is, how we're using it, and how to set it up. You can easily access that through Discord, the Delegate Cash channel, or our user guide, uh, available through the user guide link on our website or the URL shown here. Once you set up Delegate.cash, you can now use your hot wallet throughout the Cyberworkers universe to connect and get utility for your Cyberworkers assets. This includes our website, Discord, and missions coming next year. Quick note for holders, we are switching from Collab Land to this new process for token gating in Discord. So every holder will need to take an action in Discord, whether they're using Delegate.cash or not. Let's talk about the details. Setting this up is a two-step process. Step number one is setting up delegate.cash, and that's done from our website. You connect with your cold wallet once to verify ownership. You provide the address of your hot wallet that you want to delegate to, and then you execute a transaction that puts that information on chain. Step number two is to go into Discord and use our verify command with your hot wallet. This will lead you to our website where you will connect and sign to verify ownership of the hot wallet. No transactions though. You can then verify everything's working properly using the CB wallet command in Discord, which will show you your hot and cold wallet and all your assets that are in either. While we highly recommend it, it is not required to use delegate.cash for cyber brokers. If you're willing to live with fishermen and hackers trying to take your assets, that is your choice. In that case, you can skip step one, move directly to step two, and just use the wallet with your cyber broker assets in Discord to verify. Let's walk through a demo of how step one works setting up delegate.cash. Have your cold wallet ready and go to the cyberbrokers.com website. Click the connect wallet button in the upper right and then click the delegate button. Then click the connect wallet button under the instructions. Click the method to connect to your wallet. We're gonna use MetaMask in this example. Make sure to pick your cold wallet when you're connecting. Click connect to confirm. Delegate page on the website will then update, read the further instructions. You're now gonna to want to paste the hot wallet address into the delegate address field. Make sure this is your hot wallet address. Then click the delegate button. This will bring up MetaMask and initiate the transaction. You want to verify three things at the top. The first is that it's coming from cyberbrokers.com. The second is that it's a $0 transaction and the third is that it says delegate for all. At the bottom, you'll see that there is a gas fee. This is a transaction and it is required to put the information on chain. When you're ready, click confirm and the transaction will execute. Now we're gonna wait for the transaction to complete and execute on the blockchain. We'll now see the details of your delegate.cash setup, the cold wallet that connected and the hot wallet you delegated to. Congratulations, you just set up delegate.cash. If you were using your cold wallet, let's make sure that's disconnected. 
So click the connect wallet button, then click the cancel button to make sure your cold wallet connection is removed. While we're here at the website, let's connect with our hot wallet and show you how this works. Click the connect wallet button in the upper right, click your method for connecting to your wallet. We're gonna use MetaMask again in this example. This time, make sure to connect your hot wallet, not your cold wallet. Click the accept and sign button on the page and then the sign button again in MetaMask. Now you can click the view inventory page and see all your CyberWorkers assets live. Now keep in mind, all your CyberWorker assets are safely in your cold wallet while you're connecting with your hot wallet. This is the whole point of delegate.cash. Now it's time for step two, verifying your hot wallet in Discord. It's easiest to start in the support channel inside of Discord. There, start typing in the CB verify slash command as you're seeing here and paste in the wallet address for your hot wallet. Our Discord bot will then respond with instructions and a button with a link you can follow to our website. Click the button, accept the OK that you're leaving Discord, and you'll come to the Cyber Workers Verify page. If you close your browser window from the previous session, you may have to connect your wallet again. Click the Connect Wallet button below the message. It'll bring up MetaMask. Make sure to choose your hot wallet again. Click the Next and Connect buttons. Read all the instructions. Check the Got it, I'll be careful box, and then click Submit. Now ready to verify ownership of your hot wallet through a signature. Note, this is not a transaction, just a signature to verify you own the wallet. View the information and then click the Sign button. This is instantaneous and you'll see the result immediately. You can also go back to Discord and see a status update message there as well. While you're in Discord, let's verify everything's working there by using the CB wallet slash command. It will take a moment to check the blockchain for your information and then provide you back a list of your hot wallet you connected with, any cold wallets connected through delegate.cash, and then all your cyber brokers assets. Congratulations, you've now completed both steps and are set up and ready to go with Delegate.cash. Moving forward, use your hot wallet to connect to all cyber brokers sites. The only exception to this is Mech Reveal and Mech Assembly, which will require you to connect with a wallet with your Mech parts in it. If you need more information, there's lots available. Again, Discord Delegate Cash channel or our user guide from our website. And if you have any specific questions, go to the support channel on Discord. People are happy to assist you. A friendly reminder, you must complete step two, whether you're using Delegate Cash or not, to make sure you keep your token gated access to holder channels. So please do this as soon as possible. Thank you. And we are so excited to support Delegate.cash and help secure your assets.